Hey everyone, everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to, to Five Minute Eats. All right guys, today we got another beverage review for you. And this one is another dun, 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 ginger beer. It seems to be taking <laughs> the world by storm, ginger beer. Mm -hmm. And now we came across this one at Target. Yep. And I gotta admit, man, the packaging is very high end. Now, the only reason why I made us get this is the bottle. It looks really cool. This is the Bundaberg Diet Ginger Beer brewed in Australia. And it says invert bottle before opening. So we're gonna do that. Now here's the interesting thing. It's brewed in Australia, but it's bottled in the UK. So I'm like, well, what do they do? Do they ship over the brew like on a ship or something? Like Plus the name, weird. it's not very um, English. Is this German? Like an <laughs> Sure. I know, right? So that's the thing I was wondering about also, but I love the packaging. Look at that. That's cool, man. Yeah, exactly. And then you take Whoa. it off like that. You see all that? It's got like all of this gas coming out here. So that's pretty cool. I, I like that you aimed it at me. <laughs> I thought I was going to get hit. Well, you know, hazards of the job. So if you guys are new to our channel, basically we review everyday grocery items. So before you spend your hard earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. That's right. Now, it doesn't smell as strong as some other ginger beers. Yeah, I agree. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right, guys, I'm ready. I'm ready. So our rating system, thumbs up, we would buy this again. Thumbs down, we would not. So for me, guys, this is a thumbs up. This is a good product. And the reason is, if you've never tried ginger beer before, a lot of the time, the ginger is just very overpowering. Um, how would you describe ginger? Um, it Well, it's it like, has almost a little bit of an essence of a floor cleaner, kind of like astringent kind of thing going with it. And it burns. It burns. It's almost like you can feel it like snap, crackle, and popping in your like sinuses, in your mouth, down your throat. It's just like setting all these like little explosions off. And this is not as strong as some of the other ginger beer we've had. I feel this is a more balanced because some of the other ones, the ginger is really strong in there. This is a good balance. Now, um, it's sweet also because it kind of reminded me of like as if it had a little bit of lemon in it, like mm -hmm. lemonade. Mm -hmm. I checked the ingredients, it doesn't. So this is a good one. I like it. Okay, now I do believe that is the first thumbs up you've given to a ginger beer. That is correct, the first ginger beer. So hopefully one day a ginger will get a thumbs up from us, but... <laughs> 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 that took me a minute. So for me, <laughs> this is gonna be a thumbs up. I like this as well. Now I don't know if it's maybe because it's the diet version because we didn't buy like the the regular ginger beer version. Maybe that one is a little bit more like ginger in your face. But this one is a nice like dip your toes into ginger yes. beer so that you don't get scared away kind of thing. Because we started off with like literally the worst ginger beer ever, which was the San Pellegrino ginger beer. Thought we were dying, thought we were being poisoned. Because the thing about ginger is that um, it burns inside yes. as it's going down. Yes. You really feel this thing. Exactly. And now this one is, it's got a little bit of that, but it's not nearly as bad. And we've since tried some that are a little bit better, um, but this one is definitely the more like entry level ginger beer. And I think if you're like wondering how they taste and stuff, start with this one and then go to the more intense ones because those others can burn for like several minutes afterward. Whereas this one, it's nice and mild. The flavor is kind of lemony or like lemonade-y, like you said. It's it's nice, I like it. I would definitely have it again. And let's be honest, the packaging, the bottle is yes. very cool. So guys, to sum it up, thumbs up, thumbs up. And if you buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.